guns for hire in the Philippines. Oh, sorry, I need to drop my book. Um, it's not a new thing. I want to bring this up because obviously Duterte's got um, a bit of a reputation at the moment for people actually hunting people down. But I want to make people aware that it's not new. Um, what's different is the, well, almost a license to kill. I can't actually say a license to kill because I'm not 100% sure that that's legal to do so. So I would say there's a video link that's going above this. Uh, have a look because you'll see that a lot of the reasons these types of things are done is not because of something untoward or whatever. It's just much easier because they have a lot more flexibility than the police. They also don't have all the paperwork to hunt people down. Um, a lot of time the police don't want to acknowledge that they, they actually utilise these people. But at the same time they don't want to acknowledge they take bribes either. Um, but if it makes the streets of the Philippines a lot safer, I have no issue with it whatsoever. It's the same reason mercenaries get used a lot um, around the world because you can a you can get very skilled people um, from that arena but also they don't have to function under the same rules as a government and um, with rules of engagement with uh, things like legislation relating to what countries they can operate in etc because they're independent they're not actually operating for anybody um, it's normally private enterprise it's why things like Blackwater and that do quite well out of Iraq and things because they're private enterprises. The rules of engagement for military forces is very, very different. But you'll find that because these people aren't really there, there isn't a lot of tra tracking them around. They may get a bit of support from the military, etc. But at the same time, they're sort of operating independently of everybody. Um, even though the support is obviously by people that are paying them. But at the same time, they're not an operational fighting force for a nation. Anyway, thanks for watching.